Good morning. Welcome to Sunset Studios. Today we are going to make this really cute rock, which is like a worm with glasses. And I've started with a white rock that's oval shaped. I picked one that um, the pointy part I always put down in one like this because I want room up top to make the antenna. Okay, so I start with his head. And as you can see, I've drawn the design already, but I'm gonna show you again. And then the head is oval. And then I add a nice oval section of his body. I add another oval, which is a little slightly bigger. Now I'm going slightly smaller, mostly because of the shape of my rock. And then the smallest oval at the bottom. Okay. And then I'm going to do his antenna, which is basically a straight line and then sort of square going around and around. Again, other side, I'm going to do a nice big square and then just keep making square inside. Okay, and then I'll have to put in his glasses. But for now, I'm gonna get my paint ready and we'll start. Okay, my paint is poured. And whoops, the first color I'm going to use on his head is a bright yellow. So I'm just gonna get my first coat on. My rock has, it, it's smooth, but it does have a lot of holes. So I'm just gonna do the best I can with it, not worry too much. It's a rock, right? So and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick with this color. I'm going to skip the next spot and jump down to the third layer, if you will, on his body. And just spreading out my paint. And then I'm going to keep this color and I'm just going to skip again and go to the bottom layer, which I am making a little more rounded than the pencil line showed. Okay, and now I need to clean my brush and I'm gonna switch to a more orange color slightly. It's not a bright orange, it's more of a light orange that's pretty creamy. I really, I like this color. Not a huge difference from the yellow, but different enough that you notice. And again, if you are a fan of other colors, you do not have to go with the yellow and orange. I mean, this, he's totally make-believe anyway, right? So you can do whatever colors you like. But these are kind of bright, happy, springy colors. So that's why I, I like them. Okay, there we go. Now my next step is going to be to dry the paint and put a second coat. Okay, I actually did three coats. So I did dried it and I did two more coats of um, the yellow and the orange just to make them a little uh, brighter. And now what I'm gonna do is I am, hmm, I don't like how that's coming out going to dip my eraser and make some nice dots on his third layer. So not his head, but two layers down. I'm gonna pour a little more paint. The paint dries up very quickly in my studio because it's nice and cozy warm. Okay, so I'm just going straight down and straight up. Okay, maybe just add a little more. There we go. And then I'll put a maybe a dot or two on the bottom just for fun. Can't really see it that well, so I'm not gonna worry too much. Okay, there we go. All right, I don't dip it. I wipe it off with a paper towel. And then, surprisingly, it still works as an eraser, but I don't use it as an eraser because I like 
the flat tip for using it to make dots. Okay, my next step is to take my pencil and I wanna make these glasses. Now, I wanna show you, see that they are crooked, especially this side. And I did that on purpose and I like that look. And that's why I'm gonna start with pencil so I can make sure I really do make them crooked. If you wanna just make your glasses perfectly straight, that is up to you and that is of course completely fine and I'm sure that would look great too. So I am going to go, it's just, um, really it's just a rectangle and you kind of want it to come out past his head and then I'm going to make the, the line that holds the two together. Um, I'm going to kind of make it like this. There's my rectangle. There. So they're a little crooked. That's just what I want. Then I'm going to have a giant smile, okay, that really comes up into the glasses. Right? And I can make those little smile lines at the edge. And then his eyes are just two little dots right inside the glasses. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my paint pen and I'm going to outline all of this. And I'm gonna use my thinner paint pen. It's by Thule Art and it's black. And we'll see how this works. Sometimes I have, oh, it's working well. Sometimes I have better luck than others with my paint pens. Okay, so I'm just gonna go around the head. And I'm not gonna worry about the, um, the glasses line. I'm just gonna keep going. And I'm gonna go around his second layer. My dot did go into the second layer and that's fine. It really doesn't matter. I'm just gonna stop it, the line right before that dot. And now I'm down to the third layer. And again, I'm just being careful not to touch the dots because they are still wet. And then we got the last little layer. Okay. Now I want to do the eye, the glasses. So I'm going to go. Go right around and make that little line that holds them together. I'm kind of rounding the corners. There we go. And now I'm going to make his eyes. Ooh, <laughs> there's a hole right there. That's okay. There we go. And now his mouth. His giant smile with the little smile lines at the top. And then it's time for the antenna which doesn't have to be a perfectly straight line. It depends on your rock, but I'm just gonna make that square looking antenna. If you would rather just do straight lines for antennas and curve them, that is absolutely fine. There we go. Our friend is finished. I hope you enjoyed this very quick and easy video. The only thing they need our names. I hope you had fun. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Take okay, care. I know I said goodbye, but I realized I forgot the details, the, fi the finishing touches. So let's do that real quick. We have one ear here and another ear like that. And the other thing I've done is just with my paint pen, I'm just doing a few dots here and there. 
really anywhere that you like. And then a couple of lines just for no particular reason, honestly, except that they look good. And they're, I don't know why, but somehow it makes it look better. So I didn't want to leave you without that. All right, I'm going to do a couple more here and there and there and at the very bottom. Okay, and then a couple more dots. Whoopsie, that was a little more of a line. Okay, and that is it. All right, thanks for watching the finishing touches. See you soon.